The 2011-12 budget proposed to set up a 7 billion elite athletes development fund to help make the Hong Kong Sports Institute a world-class training center. This comes in the wake of a 1.8 billion investment in the institute's redevelopment, with new facilities to be ready in 2013. So the timing of the funding is is perfect because we're we've got our our strategic directions, we've got the ideas that we want to develop and now we can actually develop them. These dreams and this long-term vision that we have can suddenly get translated into actual practical plans that will help us to achieve the sustainable world-class results that we want. The Institute's plans include increasing the number of full-time athletes from 160 to 500 and bolstering its brand recognition so that more parents send their children to undergo training here. It also aims to maximize relationships with international competitors and improve its technology support for athletes. So if we look at somebody like uh, Wang Gambo, you know, who's our famous cyclist in Hong Kong, there's a huge difference between going to an international event on a bike that costs $10,000 or a bike that costs $100,000. And so we need to make sure that we have the proper resources for to, to get the best technology and the best support for the athletes that we can. The new funding would also help the Institute to boost the sports science and medicine team to give better support for elite athletes when they travel abroad for competition and get better results. With a good uh, support team, they can have more confidence to compete and then they can perform better. With the funding, we can recruit more professionals to join our team. And then we are hoping to have a more individualized support to each of the team. Each team or each sport can have specific conditioning coach specific physiotherapists and other professional support. Dr. Lee, he said the funding boost would help the institute to grow deeper and deeper. And she is confident Hong Kong athletes will have sustainable world-class results in the future. When we finish the redevelopment and when we're at 100% full running uh, with all of our new facilities and all of our new systems, Within 10 years of that, I have confidence that Hong Kong athletes, every time they go to the Olympics, they will bring back medals. Every time they go to the World Championships, we will come back with results.